beautiful angels it's Tessa of Akashic Soul Healing today I want to uh, share with you about the mystic archetype the mystic archetype is one of the wisdom keepers in our archetypal energies and I'm actually a mystic and what is a mystic a mystic is uh, someone that has a deep uh, relationship with God and literally uh, I experience um, amazing um, it's what you call like uh, ecstasy or raptures and it's not easy to um, express where it's coming from but it's so amazing and it's out of this world, these experiences. They, they are very mystical. I, I had experiences with the saints, um, with the Ascended Masters. And now I'm being called to come out and share this uh, mystical gift. The gift of... Um, healing and the blessings from the Creator or God. So I'm at this stage of truly embracing being a mystic. So a mystic is someone that has a deep connection. Um, like right now I'm doing retreats in my home. I need that uh, solitary it's kind of amazing, like, uh, you know, uh, there's a lot of archetypes, right? It's like your major 12 archetypal energies. And one of the present archetype that I have is a networker, which is really like, uh, like an opposite of my uh, nun or monk energy. As a mystic, I have this... You know, I needed time for my retreat and my s sacred space. And as a networker, there is this me who loves to share and be out there with a lot of people, different um, types of businesses. So it's, it's amazing that um, I come into a place where I could put them all together. And that's why I'm so excited to to bring the Akashic Records and Archetypes um, com uh, combined teachings. So then people can truly heal from their soul level and can understand the different archetypal energies that are presenting in their life. Like I was saying, I'm a mystic and a networker, so that is a different kind of um, shift for me. And... They also, um, they come to you and then um, you, you find a full circle of your, of your archetypal energy. And then there's uh, some time, like at, in your timeline, someone will be activated. So right now the, the mystic is activated. So this is what I'm doing, uh, studying, reflecting, having... I'm actually off for 16 days with my nursing and this is the time to to recapitulate and find this uh, fullness in uh, my archetype archetypal energies so I'm really excited to um, to assist you tomorrow I'm doing these archetypes and Akashic records my teacher is Caroline Mays uh, personally I'm you know doing I've had all her books and her CDs, and so I, I'm really here to fully share this wisdom. And I want to share one of my uh, mystical experience. So as a nurse, uh, I was um, for 25 years. I had eight years of night shift, and those eight years I was working at the Alzheimer's unit. And at 3 in the morning, I would do my rounds and literally I would hold my rosary. I was religious then. And I would pray to the Divine Mercy. And there was one month, I think it was like June, a summertime. Um, 
there were 27 people who died because I, I list them and they die when I'm there in the sh in, beside them so it was really an amazing um, you know time of my life with the dying and I asked Saint Faustina because I was doing this novena like the divine mercy for the suffering for the soul if this is the work of the divine mercy so I went on a dream like I took I took my nap because we have a break <laughs> for an hour so I took my nap and I went to this beautiful dream that I was in this garden and there was a white house and there were three angels on top of the house and there was a nun that came to me and said pick up those uh, roses and I said well where are the roses so I went and see the um, on the garden there were rose petals so I was putting them in my basket and my sister-in-law came to the dream and said who who is that so I wasn't sure if it was Saint Therese because it's uh, with the roses or if it's Saint Faustina because I was asking about this um, the work of Divine Mercy and then I woke up it was just an so profound you know when you go into this different dimension and I called my sister-in-law and I told her about the dream and she started crying and she said she just bought a white house and she and I said well and she said, I've been doing a novena to St. Faustina and the Divine Mercy. And I said, well, how come there's three angels? And she said she had miscarriage. And that was her angel. So this is like one of the experiences that I have. And uh, St. Faustina would sing in my dream, He left of thy world, he left of thy world. And I, I would go, you know, to my community and we actually did a song about the Divine Mercy who is the healeth of thy world. So I'm really um, amazed on uh, now that I'm a healer and uh, a teacher that I could put all these scenarios of my life and experiences and I'm ready to share it to the world which before I would just uh, you know <laughs> keep it to my heart and to the to the intimate people that I have in my life so this is a mystic uh, archetype and we are being called to to be out it's like mystic outside of the monastery this is what Caroline Mays uh, call us and it's really amazing time of our lives to share these gifts of God, the creator, the universe to people so they, they can awaken and really feel, you know, uh, and live their life soulfully and with meaning. So um, thank you for uh, listening. I love you all. <laughs> Namaste.